I believe we have Ruffin the passer. That looked like the initial indication of Ruffin the passer. It's 86 to nil on the board. That's if it stands up, but I don't yeah. believe it will. No, they're, it they're moving the ball. The there was no score on that. No, no score. So the scoreboard is wrong. They'll have to take that off. Yeah, they're correcting 80, it now. 80 points to nil. So that touchdown did not count. Why, Phil? What happened was they called a roughing the passer penalty, which means once the quarterback releases the ball, once mm -hmm. he throws the ball, you can't hit him. Yeah. And one of the uh, Swindon players must have hit him after he released the ball. It's a 15-yard penalty and automatic first down. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, there was no touchdown on the play. There was a penalty assessed against the Swindon Steelers that negated that touchdown. Try again. That pass, pass was broken up by number 54, Rob Moore, playing linebacker for Swindon. Intended receiver was number 88, Dave Tucker, the tight end coming across the middle. One thing I'll give Weston, they're sticking with it, they're not giving up. Yeah. You know, they're still plugging away, which is all that you can ask of them. Coombs drops back, he throws and he hits number 86. He drops the ball. Number 86, the intended receiver, Nigel Hill. Trying to run before he picked the ball. What's the yardage for the uh, Steelers full. Have you got anything sort of update on that? Yes, uh, in this uh, in this quarter so far, they've gained 145 yards, which gives them a total of 496 yards for the game. Mm. I've just been looking through the uh, and uh, the American football record book. Uh, example: the most yards gained in a game is 309 yards. Pittsburgh versus Los Angeles in 1980. I think that was possibly in a Super Bowl. I believe it was. <laughs> <laughs> you don't gain as much yards probably as anywhere else. <laughs> no. no. It looks like Weston's going to have to punt again. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, it was it was good. Of course, it slowed up a little bit in the second half, actually. Yeah. You, you're pleased and uh, okay your next game is not for a long time oh no we uh, play Torbay in two weeks yeah and then we then we have a, a four week rest in between uh, we play the Gloucester Bears and I noticed they were here scouting us today quite a few of them yeah I noticed that as well and uh, and the the best of luck in your next game and for the remaining of the season uh, to be two and nothing up at this stage <laughs> in the season must be pretty heartening especially in your first season the team played well today. I think that's the main thing. It's down to the lads on the day. Right. Yeah, I think it's great for the crowd, so hope they come out next time. Right. We can only hope. And uh, that is it from the very first uh, American football game here covered by Swindon Cable Television. We hope that you enjoyed it and that you will join us the next time we're on the gridiron. Until then, from all the team here at the county ground, a very good evening.